it's Friday and welcome today to our daily prayers as we think about offering different parts of ourselves so we think about our hands actually can we get stuck in and help in a practical way it can be all sorts of things um, hands are good for washing up for moving chairs for doing hoovering all the practical things we can do and there are so many others wonder what it might mean for you how do we use our hands to help other people maybe practically I wonder what neighbour could we show that sort of God love to let's pray together now O oh Lord open our lips and our mouth shall proclaim your praise The night has passed and the day lies open before us. Let us pray with one heart and mind. As we rejoice in the gift of this new day, so may the light of your presence, O God, set our hearts on fire with love for you, now and forever. Amen. And so we are the Good Samaritan. And you probably know the story if you've been following. A man is left half for half dead. A Levite and a priest ignore him. Verse 33 of Luke 10. But a Samaritan sea travelled came where the man was. And when he saw him, he took pity on him. He went to him and bandaged his wounds, pouring on oil and wine. He put the man on his own donkey, brought him to an inn and took care of him. The next day he took out two denarii and gave them to the innkeeper. Look after him, he said, and when I return, I will reimburse you for any extra expense you may have. I think the thing I'd like to pick out today is the Samaritan didn't just give him a cup of water and perhaps bandage up his wounds. He went the whole distance. He took the man, he gave of what he could, oil and water at the time, gave up his own donkey, took him to an inn, and paid the man not just for having him in but for the extra day's care and that was for someone who he not only didn't know but came from a completely different set of people my goodness i think it's the generosity not just doing a little thing but being generous with his giving is what strikes me today i wonder how generous are we perhaps in particular with people we really don't know or don't like or don't feel we want to be associated with. And I think God might be tapping me on the shoulder about this. How generous, how Samaritan-like are we to those people? A space for our prayers now. And so as our Saviour taught us, so we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. And so may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all, now and forevermore. Amen. <laughs>